The gang starts off their latest game with John, who plays a mountain. Then Tom plays a tap left Ortigo, surveilling a car to the top. Extra plays a tap drop fall veil. And finally, Sam plays a command tower. The real game now begins, with John playing a swamp and casting lizard blades. He passes to Tom. Tom plays a fortified village and decides to let it come in tapped. Extra plays a steam vents, paying to life, then casts an arcane signet before passing. Sam plays a forest and a Golgari signet. He then passes back to John. John plays a mountain for turn. He casts his commander, the infamous Cruel Claw, then goes to combat, attacking Extra with his blades. Extra takes the hit. Then John passes the turn to Tom. Tom follows suit, pulling a command tower, and his own commander, Helga, Skittish Seer. Once in play, he passes. Extra first casts Lotus Cobra, then plays a Dream Root Cascade, triggering Cobra to make a green, which helps him to cast Corsair of Crufix. After that, he passes to Sam. Missing a land to play, Sam first casts a Marion and Apprentice, making a servo, followed by a Ravenous Squirrel, before passing back to John. John plays a Swamp and casts a Sonic Screwdriver. He then equips his blades on Cruel Claw, which is sent at Tom. Cruel Claw triggers twice, exiling two cards, one of which is Alchemist's Greeting, which has John discard a card in order to take down Corsair. After the spell resolves, John gives a turn to Tom. Tom plays a Glacial Fortress and a Thunderous Snapper, triggering Helga to gain a counter, draw a card, and gain one life. With nothing else to play, he passes. Extra first casts an Oracle of Moldiah, followed by a Storm Carp Ghost from the top, triggering Cobra. Next is an Explorer, Alongside a tap, Thundering falls from the top, surveilling a card to the graveyard, and making another mana with Cobra. He plays a soul for falls, during Cobra a final time, and ends the turn with a Faldorn, Dread Wolf Herald. Sam simply casts a Black Market Connections, attacks John with his apprentice and squirrel, and passes him the turn. John starts his turn by attacking Sam with Cruel Claw. In response, Tom casts Path to Exile on said Cruel Claw, replacing it with a Mountain. Wanting a bit of revenge, John casts a Terminate on Helga and gives the turn to Tom, feeling slightly better than he did before. Tom plays a Bountiful Promenade and recasts his commander, Helga, get his seer. Next, he sends his Snapper at John and passes to Extra. Extra first casts Aerith. Tormented Prophet, then activates Faldorn, discarding a card, to exile his top card. He plays a tapped Cinder Glade from the top, triggering Cobra, followed by his commander, Flubs the Fool. Next he casts Birds of Paradise, triggering Flubs, but is interrupted by John and his Infernal Grasp on Aerith. Extra then plays a Mountain, triggering Cobra and Flubs to draw, a tap Divine Glimmer Snarl, Triggering Cobra and Flubs, and finally a Growth Spiral from Exile, triggering Flubs to discard, and Faldorn to make a wolf. With all that out of the way, he passes the turn to Sam. On Sam's upkeep, connections trigger, paying six life, make a treasure, draw a card, and make a 3 2 shapeshifter. He plays an Undergrowth Stadium, and finally casts his commander, Hazel of the Root Bloom, who triggers on end of turn making another treasure. John's only play for the turn is a recast of his commander, the infamous Cruel Claw, and a pass. Tom then starts his own turn with a forest, then casts Soul Ring. He then proceeds to cast a Hungering Hydra for X equals 4, triggering Snapper to draw, and Helga to gain a counter, draw, and gain one life. Once everything is resolved, he passes the turn to Extra. Extra first activates Faldorn, discarding a card to exile his top card. In response, Sam casts Assassin's Trophy on Oracle of Moldiah, 
replacing it with a forest. Extra then plays the forest, triggering flubs to draw, followed by a flurry of spells, those being Sicker or Tribe Scout, triggering flubs, Druid class, triggering flubs, Rapid Hybridization Hazel, triggering flubs, Currency Converter, triggering flubs, and Chaos Orb on Helga, triggering flubs. With the final trigger still on the stack, and his mana low enough, Tom jumps in with a stroke of Midnight on flubs, taking him out to the relief of the rest of the table. Warp then finally resolves, putting Atlanta War Elves into play. Not done just yet, Extra cast the Exile Tireless Provisioner, Troy Faldorn to make a wolf, before passing the turn. On Sam's upkeep, connection is trigger, paying 6 life to make a treasure, draw a card, and make a 3-2 shapeshifter. He cast Insidious Roots, alongside his commander, Hazel of the Root Bloom, triggering his effect on end of turn to make two more shapeshifters. John first equips Blades onto Cruel Claw, then activates Screwdriver, giving Cruel Claw unblockable. Next, he sends Cruel Claw at extra, triggering its effect, first discarding a card to cast the Exiled Kedis, Ember Claw Familiar, followed by yet another Exile, and a Kedis trigger to deal 3 damage to each other opponent. Once the damage is dealt, he passes the turn. Tom plays a Branch Loft Pathway and cast Tribute to the World Tree. He then, for a third time, recasts his commander, Helga, Skittish Seer, triggering Tribute to give it two counters. He attacks Extra with his Hydra, which gets blocked by a human, triggering the Hydra to add another counter. After combat, he gives the turn to Extra. Extra first activates Faldorn, discarding a card to exile his top card. Next, he recasts his commander, Flubs the Fool, followed by another set of spells and lands, those being Burgeoning, triggering Flubs to the draw, Dryad of the Elysian Grove, triggering Flubs, a Crack Crown Pathway, triggering Provisioner, Flubs, Cobra, and Druid class, for finally ending his casting spree with a Beast Within on Hazel, triggering Flubs one final time to draw a card. With that, he hands the turn over to Sam. On Sam's upkeep, connection triggers, paying 6 life to make a treasure, draw a card, and make a 3-2 shapeshifter. He casts both Parallel Lives and Tireless Provisioner before playing a Swamp, triggering Provisioner to make two treasures. He then casts an Arcane Signet, a Nature's Lore, getting a Forest, and making two more treasures with Provisioner. Like Tom, Sam also recasts his commander, Hazel of the Root Bloom, for the third time, ending the turn with a Hazel trigger, making four shapeshifters. John again activates Screwdriver onto Cruel Claw, making it unblockable. He then sends said Cruel Claw an extra, triggering its effect to exile twice, deciding to discard a card in order to cast Prosper, Tomebound. Kedis also triggers twice, dealing a total of 6 damage to both Tom and Sam. John then ends the turn with a Prosper Exile and a pass to Tom. Tom plays a Sea of Clouds and casts a Beast Whisper, triggering Helga and Tribute to add two counters. He casts Turok and Goreclaw, triggering Whisper, Snapper, Helga, and tribute the draw, followed by a Feral Hydra for X equals 5, triggering everything again, alongside a Siroc trigger, giving the Hydra a counter and haste. With all his mana spent, he sends everything at Sam, even the summoning Sith Beast Whisper. Sam blocks the Whisper with two shapeshifters, Feral Hydra with another two shapeshifters, and Snapper with Hazel plus Squirrel. After damage, Apprentice triggers 4 times, making each opponent lose 4 life, before Tom gives the turn to Extra. Extra first activates Baldorn, discarding a card to exile his top card. The Flubs train then begins again, so let's get this over with quickly. Soul Ring, Tap Ketria Triome, Training Center, 
Conduit of Worlds, Kadama's Reach, Rejuvenating Springs, Activate Sakura, putting a mountain into play, Level of Druid class, Exiled Forest, Bestow Nantuko onto Dryad, Inti, Senesol of the Sun, Activate Converter to Dropless Discard, Trigger Inti, Exiled Conspiracy Theorist, and finally, Splendid Reclamation. Running out of options, Extra Attack Sam with a Wolf, Trigger Inti to Discard, Add a Counter, and Exile the top card. The Wolf is blocked by Hazel, and the turn can finally go to Sam. On Sam's upkeep, Connections trigger, paying one life to make two treasures. He plays a tap Underground Mortuary, Surveilling to the Graveyard, and Triggering Provisioner to make two food. Falls by an Awaken the Woods for X equals 16, making 32 tokens, each Triggering Provisioner to make 64 tokens, which are then quickly sacrificed, as Sam finally realizes Apprentice works on artifacts. With this epiphany, he is able to take out all three of his opponents and prevent Extra from getting another 20-minute turn.